Hey guys, welcome to another lunchtime review. Today I'm going to try one of these PF Chains home menus. I think these are fairly new. At least they're new in our area. This one is the chicken lo mein. It is lo mein noodle bowl with chicken breast, shiitake mushrooms, carrots, celery, onions, and peas with a savory garlic and ginger sauce. We bought, and it looks really good. We bought this at Meyer. It was $4.49, which um, less than $5 for a meal. I, don't, I mean, you know, it's better than going out to eat. 410 calories for the entire bowl. And here's your other stuff for you. Sardine's actually not even that bad for an Asian meal. It's pretty good. Okay, we're going to use the directions to cook this thing. With this. So we're going to cook it in the microwave only. So uh, microwave on, okay, cook one at a time. Do not cook on conventional or toaster oven. Okay, microwave on high for four to five minutes. No need to vent. So four to, I'll probably do four and a half. Stir and then make sure it's hot. And that's pretty much it. So four and a half minutes. Don't vent it or anything like that. What does this puppy look like? It looks like that. Wow, that's a pretty good size. That's pretty full. It's a pretty full bowl. So uh, I'm going to get this in the microwave um, for four and a half minutes and I'll be back. Alright, here it is out of the microwave and it smells really good. Um, I don't see tons of sauce, but I mean there's enough sauce. Definitely co coating everything. Um, it's not overwhelmed with sauce, which is probably a good thing, honestly. So I'm going to let this cool off for a bit. Steam still rising, and uh, I'll be right back. Okay, I got me a bite ready. I didn't see a lot of mushrooms in here. I'm gonna dig around and make sure um, there's not some mushrooms laying about because I love mushrooms. I don't see a lot in here. So this has chicken, peas, noodles, and onions. Uh, I didn't get a carrot either, but I'll, I'll get one in the next bite. Let me try this first. Hmm. There's a mushroom. It's got some spice to it. Not um, not like burn your mouth off spicy, but it definitely has some spice to it. Let's see. I'm assuming it's the the ginger giving me the spice. I'm trying to get it to where I can actually eat this without making a complete and total mess. Okay, here we go. This one has a mushroom in it. And lots of needles. Mm. I like that. I like that quite a bit. Let me try one of the mushrooms by itself because, um, like I said, I love mushrooms. Got that good chewy um, texture with that earthy uh, flavor level. Anyway, um, overall the flavor of these are really good. I love the texture of the noodles. The noodles are are um, really nice. They're they have a little bit of a uh, toughness a pull, you know when you're buying through them, but not um, they're not mushy. They're not hard. So that's good the uh, The flavors of the vegetables and the meats and the, the mushrooms and the peas and all that stuff go really good together And the sauce is excellent. It's not it, you definitely get the garlic But you don't it's not overwhelmingly garlic and it does have that little bit of uh, that spice from that ginger Just like if you eat a ginger snap cookie It's not quite that strong, but you do get that little bit of, of uh, heat in the back of your throat Um I think this is really good. I would, if I were to go to the restaurant, I wouldn't have any problems at all ordering this if it tastes like this because this is really good. So I'm going to give this one, um, I can't imagine anything they could do better for it. It's really good. It has good flavors, good textures. Uh, there's a good amount of it. Um, price is a little high, but if you were to go to the restaurant and get this, I guarantee it's going to be more than $5. So uh, I'm going to give this one a five. There's absolutely nothing wrong with it. I would eat this all the time if, if it was, uh, if I needed to. So uh, I hope you enjoy this video and thanks for watching.